Hello everyone and welcome to another unboxing of Cycle Tech Review. Um, before we start the unboxing, I thought I'd go through some bits and pieces. Uh, first of all, I've got to apologise for the lighting. We've had a couple of lights has gone down. Sorry about that. So it's a bit, bit moody. Um, I've got some glasses that have come from uh, Engo Eyewear. These are augmented reality glasses. Now, augmented reality sounds quite cool. It's not virtual reality, it's augmented reality. Um, so what they use is they have some sort of clever technology hidden in the nose bridge that projects onto the inside of the glasses lens. Um, and what this does, although it's permanently there, um, you only see it when you focus on it. So it's in your field of vision, but if you're looking down the road, you don't see it. It's only when you pull your focus as such that you actually see it. So what this does is it frees you up from looking down at your head unit, looking back up again, looking down, looking up. So for safety um, reasons, it's, that's quite good because obviously, especially off road, um, taking your eyes off the path in front or the trail in front or the next junction coming up, you don't really want to do that. So by having it in your field of vision, hopefully it'll make for a safer ride. Um, you can choose what data you have up in, in, that, in your field of view as well. Um, and so what you can do is put the data that's really important. So if you're doing intervals and stuff like that, you want the metrics, maybe it's heart rate you're working to, maybe it's power. You want that there, right there in front of you. So you know you're sticking to it and if you're doing what your coach has told you to do, rather than it being on your on your wrist, say, if you're running and it's on your watch, or if it's on your head unit, you, you know, you're not really aware of it. But by keeping it up here in, in your field of view, Hopefully, maybe it's going to make for a better training experience. Um, and it's, you're not going to have um, things like text messages popping up and stuff like that. This is a purely um, a system for improving your training. Um, so anyway, let's let's take let's take a look at the box and see see what they send us, and uh, let's get unboxing. Okay, so we've got two boxes here from uh, Engo Eyewear. Let's get inside and see what we have got. Um, Oh, nice looking pair of glasses there. Engo Active Look. Sorry for the clattering sound in the background. That's me just chucking the box. Active Look. Um, Engo Smart Eyewear for Athletes. Some instructions. And oh, what's this? Uh, display customizable in different com uh, configurations. Get the free Active Look mobile look. Uh, mobile app from your favorite app store and pull here to activate well, that sounds interesting or maybe I'll pull pull from that side instead welcome to Engo let me get that on the screen for you that pulls away quite nicely oops um, and we have got an Engo 2 standard white oh let's have a look Engo, powered by Active Look. That's the road. Instructions. Case. Uh, you've got um, a safety leash to keep it connected. Charger cable. That looks like it's, yeah, it's a um, magnetic connection there. Don't know what those are look like cleaning buds of some sort a little protective case there cleaning cloth another cleaning and some more instructions okay let's have a look at the glasses then let's put that to one side nice case there with the engo logo and a little carry strap there wow nice Tell you what, considering it's got some technology whacked away in it, presumably it's a battery, a projector, and some they're not they don't feel heavy. Um, let me see if you can get a a look at the uh the gubbins there. It's uh clattering on my can you see that there? That's the um projector I want to say I think this piece here is what actually projects onto your 
or is that the mirror? Now this is a projector, this is a mirror, and this is, I think, where your battery is, and this is where all the uh, software is hidden. There's an on-off button there, charger port. They look pretty nice, actually. And like I say, I'm, they don't feel heavy. The lenses look like they should be interchangeable, I guess. And you've got some small grub screws here. Sorry, my fingers in the way. So you've got some small grub screws there. Um, and I think the lens is specially treated so that when it projects, it will actually show up. I don't know. If, can we see anything? Let's turn it on. Maybe it needs charging yet. Let's have a look. No, I think it might need charging first. Um, you've got a couple of sensors here as well. Um uh, or one sensor. I think one is a, a light sensor, so that detects how much light, ambient light there is, and that sort of ramps up the power. And I'm, if I'm right, I think these are photochromatic lenses in, the, in that they will adjust according to the light levels. So that's the Engo 2. Let's put him in his carry case because we don't want to... Oh, it's on. I've just realized, I don't know if you can see in there, but it's projecting. You see the light there? It is actually projecting. Um, I mean, it obviously won't show up for us, but I'll, I'll turn it off again. Yeah, that looks like it's, I think that's off. Um, maybe I was dreaming, who knows. Okay, let's put those back and away. Keep them protected, got to protect your sunnies. Uh, the case has got a little storage space there. Which I'm guessing might have something to do with those, these little cleaning tabs. Maybe they, well, we'll find out what they do. And there's your cleaning cloth. Put that all nice, nice and neatly tucked away. There we go. And let's have a look at, because I know there are two sizes of lens. So maybe what we've got here is the two sizes. Let's have another look. Another box about to fall on the floor. There we go. That certainly look the picture looks bigger. Let's try this little zip again. That's very satisfying, isn't it? Open her up. And I've got to um, download the app, as I said, bef before we start using this. Another proper... Oh, it's a black pair. Yeah, and you can see they're slightly larger. Let's get the other one out that I so carefully put away because I'm, I'm good like that I must admit I normally buy quite cheap lenses because uh, glasses because I tend to lose them or scratch them so oh yeah you can see there two different sizes you've got a, a bigger pair here they've got the same vents at the bottom presumably to aid with airflow and these just got a black frame and they look like they've got yeah a nice sort of grippy rubber piece there but you can see the, the lenses are, are taller on this black pair. Same technology inside them, just a, a different style. Um, probably this one will be nicer for the runners and the bigger one for the cyclists. I'll be trying out both sets anyway. Um, I do occasionally run. Not great at it. Um, don't do enough of it to feel comfortable. But I'll try both. Uh, let me, let me, there we go. You can see both there. So that's the Engo 2 using active look technology and we'll be trying those out i'll put a preview up with all the technology and the details of how they work and then i'll um i'll be using them and i'll let you guys know how how i fare with that thanks for listening goodbye there